Hello everyone and welcome to Quality Olds Games. Today we are making another one sentence description for units video and this time we are taking goal units. And the description or sentence is based on campaign setting, so in addition to fighting capabilities, the all, also the requirements and unit price are taken into account. And I try to include a bit of humor here as well, so don't take these sentences too seriously. At the same time, I strive to make the sentences so that they uh, include a nice summary of the unit in any case. But without further ado, let's begin. First we have Barbarian Cavalry. Why I get the feeling that especially the Gaul variant is breaking when it is hitting the enemy in the back. Early Bodyguard. I guess the only solid cavalry unit the Gauls have, though the question remains how to train them. Late Bodyguard. They had to give all the Gauls some slight upgrade from Marian reforms, as otherwise Gaul could be trampled by post-Marian Romans. Barbarian Noble Cavalry. It's your choice to leave it or take it, as it is the best cavalry Gaul can train. War Dogs. Speaking of the best cavalry, it seems riders are pretty much only a hindrance, as these good boys show. Cavalry overall. Gaul cavalry roster is quite on par with the other aspects of their roster, and this is not a positive verdict. Chosen swordsmen. These are the finest infantry Gaul has, and they have a nice war cry, however facing other elite units with them makes me want to cry. Druids. Perhaps they should go to pay a visit to one small village of indomitable Gauls to learn some more useful tricks. Naked fanatics. I mean, if you want to goof around with some naked guys, do so by all means, but in battle bring for example swordsmen instead. Peasants. At least in this department, the Gauls are pretty much on par with other factions. Hooray! Swordsmen. This is such a nice tier 2 unit, especially with Warcry that Gaul roster could use similar quality also in other tiers. Warband. Not quite that far from Eastern Infantry in terms of usefulness, and material for memes. Infantry overall. They would do okay against other factions infantry if they were located in the eastern part of the campaign map. Forester Warband. Gaul specialty unit which is dirty expensive but good even against cavalry, though not quite so against infantry. Skirmisher Warband. These guys just got it bad, as they don't even have any longer spears available, so they could join Spear Warband. Missile units overall. It's rather hard to rate the Gaul missile units overall, as they are nearly non existent, but in case you didn't know, you should go for Forester Warbands instead of Skirmisher Warbands. Gaul overall. It was really nice of their developers that they made Gaul as the easiest to stomp faction in the game, because now the Julii will salute the devs. So, what do you think? Do you agree or disagree? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments. And if you like the video, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Both of those will help a great deal. And very special thanks to channel members, your support is greatly treasured. Have a great rest of the day, Quality Old Games, out.